Hi everyone, it's Karen Jean, and welcome, welcome, welcome. If this is your first time here, I hope you enjoy it. We are continuing with our second Shabby Dabby Doo Doll inspired journal. What I did with this, remember this was the, uh, I was stenciling, I did these using my stencil and then when I was cleaning the stencil, I just, you know, wet it down and then I used this paper to get the negative from it. Then I went over it. Anyway, I trimmed it down a little because it's just going to be, it's going to fit in here. It's just a lovely journaling card. I might do something. I might ink edges. I, might, I don't know. It just might leave it the way it is. <coughs> Excuse me. And today is Monday, uh, the day after Palm Sunday in March. Don't, I don't know what date, what the date is. I think maybe the 25th. And it's been a few days since I've been up in here doing anything. Let me see if I can get a little organized here. Ugh, there we go. I went to, I had a rental car this weekend. It goes back tonight after my brother's um, audiologist appointment. And uh, my daughter's best friend is getting married in September. And uh, so I was at the fabric store and I saved $360 at the fabric store. We won't talk about the 200 I spent in order to save the $360, but not all of that is for a quilt for her friend. Uh, there's a, a batik fabric. I bought a batik fabric for the back of my quilt, and it's 108 inches wide, so it's perfect. And it was 70% off, so I bought the, all seven yards. I was only going to buy the three yards I needed at $40 a yard, but it was 70% off. So there we go. Anyway, everything was on sale. It's Joanne's. I understand Joanne's is having difficulty. And this was on sale, and I thought that would look really nice in this journal. And it's actually, it has a bit of a stretch to it, a um, bit of elastic to it. So... I thought it would be, it might be a little bit too wide for page edging, but I thought it would make a very nice addition to this journal. Okay, so we're going to continue in this journal. This um, is a journaling card I made with some tissue paper that I have. I don't know if I'm going to put it in this journal or not, because I think the colors might be, it might be a not. It might be a not color-wise. Color-wise, it might be a no. It might be a no. So, okay, so I need to get my head situated because I don't even know what we're doing. We still have all these pieces here that, and I love this right here, the names and numbers in this here, and this is our scrap. Okay, so, or glue book, I should say. Um, now, we have to think, do we want to put pockets on the inside of the covers. What do we want to do with the inside of the covers? We could put pockets there. This is very pretty. It's a statement. It's a statement piece, right? So I'm not sure I really want to do anything with that. I might at the very end, maybe go over it with a little bit of glossy accents or, or something. I don't know. I don't know. We'll think about that. But we do have the other side of these. We have two of them, so that's four. We have four pages like this that we need to figure out what we're going to do with. Um, and how. And then we also have this side. So what are we going to do? We could collage. We can do pockets. What are we going to do? And here we have the signature center, right? And these are uh, pockets are a bit gusseted. So what are we going to do there? What we can do, we can do some collage, more collage work here, if we so desire. And then something like this, you know, we could, it would have to be trimmed down some. We could just glue that down and, and for journaling cards, right? We could do that as journaling cards. And here we need to, to decorate this up somehow. Now I have, we have here, 
Oh, I think I, I have one of these roosters out somewhere. I actually might have it out in the signature center. The journaling cards. We did these together. We did all this together, right? We did the... I'm pretty sure we did all that together. Like I said, it's been a couple of days, so I have no memory. I have no memory um, of it. So, hmm. All right, so we do have these. Now this rooster, which is a rather large rooster, rather pretty rooster, but large, large and in charge. So we could do something with that. What else are we going to do? Let me think, 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 think. Ugh. Um, over here in the bucket. Oh. We have stickers, right? Make sure you've seen those stickers. These are from, <clears throat> these are from Hobby Lobby. But they're awfully adorable. Uh, most, uh, most of these stickers are, yes, Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree. Let's take these out. Take that out. Pretty, pretty. Um, we also have these. I'm going to just put these aside for the moment. We also have these, which are um, flower. They're picks. They had toothpicks in them for, like, cupcakes and stuff. Pretty sure I got these at... Well, no, I don't care about those. At, um... Take a couple of these out. Michael's. Pretty sure I got those at Michael's. And because this is my last day with the car... Oh, I've gotten all the stuff out of my bedroom into the back of the car so that I can take it to the thrift store. So I am happy about that. There's the opening right there. Let's see if I can do this. Um, I am having difficulty separating these. Oh, there it goes. Because if I want to, what I want to do is I want to be able to glue it down in the journal or on a journaling card. And I would like to be able to get two for one out of the deal, right? Which I'm not going to because I think I just ripped it there. But even if I can't get two for one out of the deal, I... <clears throat> excuse me, I need to uh, flatten it. So for like, for like, where is it? For like, for like, for like... Put that there, and then we can put that, that's not the one. We can do the part that I just ripped if I can line it up again, like that. Actually. Actually, why don't we do that? We'll use the precision tip. I'm doing the whole thing because I don't know. There going off the top which is fine and now the back of it and I think I know to put it all together again I think this one goes here it goes right there 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 we go. And I like how that looks. I think it matches this paper very nicely. 
I do, I do. And just so nobody feels left out, I was thinking of the animal stickers from Hobby Lobby, except that I can find the animal stickers from Hobby Lobby. I just had them. Um, I think they're kind of going to, kind of going to, kind of going to disappear with that. I need to put the cow down here. Okay. Lovely, lovely. Now, we also have these Dollar Tree puff things, but let me go to these Dollar Trees. These I really don't think I'm going to use because of the black. Um, also, hold on just a second. Let me get this here. You can go away. We could put a piece of this greenery up here. I will save the cardboard packaging. That would be a nice... Use this one. Um, put that for the back of a journaling card. So we'll put this right here. Okay, and now these are different colors. I was going to offset it, but it's the color is way too different than that in order to offset it. So, okay, so we can. I don't know. Hold on. Let me see if I can find a paler one. No. Completely different wrong color as well. Let's see. It's a bright yellow. These are more orange. Okay, let's keep on looking. Let's keep on looking. And let's not find a darn thing, a darn thing, a darn thing. Okay. Okie dokie artichokey. Pulling this out because I want to do something with that. I don't know what I want to do with that, but I want to do something with it. So I'm pulling it out. And also these are the wrong color as well. Okay, so, well, that's fine for now. Now, we said, well, I could make it a pocket, but I don't want to waste these pretty flowers on, on just a pocket there. This is a bit heavy. Um, it's heavy because of the journaling cards that are in it. We could put it, here we go, we can make... We can make pockets for two of the four pages, right? Do we want to put a pocket here? No, we don't want to put a pocket there. We'll put a pocket here. Mm. Where's the other? The other is back here. We could put a pocket here. We could put a pocket here. No, 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 no. Okay. 10 inches, perfectly fine. Cut on a half five, but then we'll make it gusseted. We're just going to have to trim it down this way. Well, I can make it a deep pocket. 
because it'll lose it'll lose about a little bit because of the gusset. That there needs to be covered up with something. And that is where this can come in. This pretty flower right there too. We're going to say that. That'll that'll look nice somewhere. this or uh, the other option is we can uh, put washi tape down there and we might put washi tape down there to anchor it a little bit correct correct now we have this washi tape but I'm not going to do that washi tape um, I have not pulled out any I haven't pulled out any other washi tape we have this washi tape we can use. There we go. And I'm going to cut that off there as well. Now, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. There. There we go. One way to save my fingers. Oops. And where did I say I was putting it? Was I put I was putting it back here, I believe. Right down there. There. Okay. And then I don't know. Now I don't know. We could put anything there. Let me first clean my little mess up here for the moment. Oh, for heaven's sakes. Okay. So this is going to be five inches. I'm going to use this little one because, because, okay, five inches. There we go. And now for the mini scoreboard, I'm going to do, oh, it's going to be a deep pocket. We will do a quarter of an inch on each side, which will make it uh, four and a half inches. Whoops shifted excuse me there now this is how big is this four inches I'm going to do a half an inch on the bottom Norm normally my pockets would be like two and a half inches this will take it to three inches considering that these pages are a little bit smaller than my normal size pages that might even be a bit too, not enough might be a bit not enough miter the corners a little bit let's see what we got going okay I 
leave that aside because we have another one to do. It's a deep pocket. All right. Let's do this one. So we're doing quarter an inch and a quarter of an inch and a half an inch and miter corners and just angle those in a little bit. need to be this needs to be angled in a little bit more it has a little overlap there which will create a little bulk there that's better that one's fine where's the other one I don't know the other one disappeared that quickly. What do you know? Around here somewhere, one would hope. Oh, there it is. Check these here. It's catching just a little bit on this one. So we will just go ahead and do that. Okay. Now, do we want to ink around it? We can. I'm not so sure how necessary it is, but we'll do it because, because we'll do it. And we can also, after we put this down, decorate it a little bit. So what projects are you people working on? Are you working on anything new? Um, I've ordered some things. I've ordered some <laughs> sunflower washi tapes because I'm almost out of this one and that's all I have. And then this other one, I only have a couple of flowers left on that. So I ordered some sunflower washi tapes. I also ordered a couple of uh, dyes. <clears throat> Excuse me, new dyes. I haven't gotten new dyes in a while, I don't think. And um, I think I'll put this one here. Yeah, so, I don't know, let's see. They should be here. Well, actually, I don't know. The things I got ordered from Amazon will be here like in a couple of days. I did place an order on scrap from scrapbook.com. That order, I know, is adhesives. I ordered a, a two, a four, and a six inch roll because um, I don't have a four inch, but my two and my six are needing, yeah, um, are gonna be running out soon. Okay, so there's that. Look, we can put this. There we go. Actually, hold on. Let's flip back here. There. That works. That works there. Okay, so we have 
three flowers left. I'm going to place this one up here just because, just because I want to, just because I want to. I'm looking to see. No, there's no. All right. I have here in front of me uh, regular size field notes, not tiny field notes. Ooh. I could have tiny field notes. What I really want when I'm keeping, and I need to go thrifting. One day I'll go thrifting. Um, I want an old typewriter, an old typewriter. Could be electric. I don't care. I know. Um, no, we're, we're not doing mushrooms. I know. Um, uh, we are memory keepers. Does have a typewriter? I I've looked online. Typewriters, even old ones, are not cheap, not inexpensive. I find them to be rather pricey. Rather pricey. I um see. In the background, you know, um, quite a few creators do, do have the We Are Memory Keepers typewriter. Uh, it's a pretty, you know, We Are Memory Keepers mint green color. But I would be, you know, just as happy to get one from a thrift store if it works. Now this is see the field notes are nice, but this is like scientific botanical kind of stuff, which is not farmyard, which is not farmyard sunflowers picnic in the grass kind of thing. It's not, not 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 not. Um, so maybe field notes are not are not the thing for us. I'm just looking at, uh-huh. This is because I have too many things up here and oh, not enough room. Might use those field notes. I'll not be using field notes. Okay. Oh. Sorry about the crash, my friends. Sorry about sorry about that crash. Now, this is such fun, actually. I realize these are not the right scissors. But what do you think if we put that there? I, I'm thinking I like it. I like it to put it there. Oof. And I like this ribbon, this crinkly whatever ribbon.
Okay. Now, if we go back to the... What about if we stick one of our roosters? Mm -hmm. Not quite. Duck is too big. Horse, we're not going to use a horse. Cow. We could put Bessie the cow. We need to put something behind Bessie the cow to anchor Bessie the cow. Kind of blending with Bessie the cow. These here are scraps, just scraps of paper that came from England. introduce a new element of butterflies. That's a whole new element. It's the right colors though. I had it, then I lost it. That's what I was planning on doing, though. I'm pretty sure it's not what I was planning on doing. Okay, we need to do something with the envelopes too. Here we have a pocket. We need to make a journaling card.
Bella. Okay, we're just going to, oops. Put a thin bead down and put this down. This it comes up with in my fingers. Oh. Okay. There. And here. Now do we do we want to use this one? gonna do a thin thing of the fabric fix right along up on the edge there this is narrow crocheted but that's okay I'm gonna get it there we'll trim it there there That one and that one. Where's my other ones? Here we go. Let's use this one. I like this one because it's a little bit more, I don't know, rough, I guess. Now, do we actually want to use it here in the signature center? Sure, why not? Okay. Oh, now I need to look at thin ribbons. Bear with me just a second. Pulled a couple of different things. I think, th well, this is a little bit wider, but I like it a lot. Look at this, right? Oh, yes, yes. Let's do this. We're going to use this here. right on top of that. Right like that. Right like that. And we're gonna put it here as well. This is a pocket here, so. Let's see how that looks. Hmm. I do like that. I like that very much. I wonder if. What would it look like here next to that? Maybe not. Okay, here we could do an orange. Actually, this stuff might be too narrow. I have glue on my fingers and it's bothering me, but 
par for the course. Yes, yes, par for the course. Definitely par for the course for me. This is Craft Smart, so this is from Michaels. I don't have that much of it left. How much is on the roll? Three yards. It's usually, you know, up front by the registers, you know, all those bins. That make the path to the registers. That's where I find it. Okay, let's make sure. Okay. put this down this here. Sure we do. Why not? Now, for this one, we need to put it across the top. Across the bottom and up and up. Get over there. And with that, I'm going to go wash the glue off my hands. Okay. And then I need to, I'll be back later. I'll be back later. I have errands to run. Definitely need to wash the glue off my hands. So, um, but I will end the video here. Okay, let's do a flip through. See what we've done. We've um, edged some pages with some pretty lace ribbon trimmings, whatever we're calling it there. Uh, we put in a couple of uh, gusseted pockets. We did that, we did that, put that there. Let's make sure this isn't... Any glue stick in here. Signature center. We need to make journaling cards for that. We decorated that. And we put that down. Okay. So we're good to go for the moment. That's what we've done thus far. This is Karen Jean. Thank you so much for your time and attention. I appreciate you spending your valuable time with me. Remember to let your imagination fly away and take you along for the ride. Thanks for stopping by and I'll see you next time.